Hello again everyone, thank you for joining me, I hope you're all well. Okay, so back into the second episode now of um, Service IT, and um, in the last one I kept making mistakes and I, so um, let's see whether I can rectify them today. Um, okay, so how do I put everything in there? Um, okay, so <clears throat> can I just do this? I think they go in there. Um, okay, let's put them in there. Right, so next. Um, <laughs> there's probably a much better way of doing this. And there. Okay, so then I've got that one, which goes up there. Okay, so after recording, I remembered that you're meant to look on the actual... Uh, on the top so I think that let's have a quick look so 9.9 10.1 so I think that's an O1C that needs to go in there yep take one of them and oh my how do I do this um jolly stop now no, how do I do that? Right, so that's there. Um, okay, so I've still got it on me. Right, and then, uh, what's that, five? Um, so how do I... <laughs> how do I get that? I need that in there. Um, how about, uh -huh. okay, so if it's in your inventory, you can just click it across. Right, sorry about this, everyone. So I always leave all this kind of stuff in because, um, yeah, I never pretend to be perfect. Um, and I do really like this game, so I didn't do that great, um, the first episode, but I'm going to do a few episodes because um, I do think that we should be promoting games like this because um, it teaches you stuff and yeah I think it's really good um, okay right so that's done now let's turn that off because that was very loud wasn't it and next off we need to check the other ones on here so um, the multimeter isn't turned on Johnny switch that on um and I think this needs to be on 20. Where's me uh, bit of paper? Where's the paper gone from down here? Um, yeah, so that's broke as well. No, because I don't know whether I'm in the right range. Um, so let's click that. Oh, you can't make it go the other. Yes, you can. Um, shift. No, it's not going the other way. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, so over there, it looks like you have to use shift and right mouse button, but it's actually shift and left mouse button. Right, uninstalling. I'm not joking. Okay. So, click it one more. I don't know what I'm doing. Can you tell? Right, zoom into that. And that's an 8 to 1. So, let's just pop another one in anyway. One of them. Yep. Okay. So, number 2. And then let's desolder that and replace it. I'm probably going to be making loads of mistakes, but I am trying my best. I'm not purposely trolling. Right, 300. Okay, um, pop that away. Take that out and pop a new one in. Solder an iron. Do it up again. 
Nice. Okay. And then we need to test this. So, I don't know what I need to put this at. Was it 2.11? Probably going to blow it up, Jolly. Right. And then let's have a look at that. Right. That's red. Okay. Um, and I think... There we go. Turn that off. So, have I just melted that? Could be. No. Red means that it's not working properly. What's that? Turn on lamp. Ah. Very nice. Um. Right, I'll be back in just a moment. Okay, sorry about that. So, we need to replace this one. So, this one isn't in the right parameter. So, yeah. Six. And it needs to be something other. Right, so, switch that back on. And not ready yet. Still not ready yet. There we go, 300. Right, so 102. Yoink, yoink. Pop that down, take that, and get a 102. There we go, that one. Yep. Um, news, eco, and trendy. I presume that's an email or something. Okay, right, yep, one of them, and solder it back in there. Nice, and, um, I don't think that was glowing green before. Um, okay, so how about now? So if I switch this on at the back, green, perfect, so that's done now, so let's Switch that off again. Unplug that. And then we need to pop this on. So slowly but surely I'm getting there. It's quite the learning curve. How it all works. But I think really. Like most of my subscribers know that I'm not a particularly fast learner. Oh no don't remove it. I think I'm doing okay, which means that the controls must be quite intuitive. Okay, so that there should be done now, and um, I can't remember how you complete the thing though. How do I like do this? Do I confirm it on the email? Um, so, we haven't done that one. This one. No, it's on the mobile phone, isn't it? No. I shouldn't have said it's quite intuitive, should I? Because I've messed it up now. Um, maybe it's that email. No. No. Contracts. Is it over here? Oh no, maybe I haven't done it. Okay, well, I think I have, so I'm going to leave that one for now. And then we need to do this board. Okay, so we did get this little thing come up. Um, so, 402s. No, because they're all 402s. Bugger it. Um, what about over here? Does it tell me anything? Um, read the file. Oh, look, here we go. Um, 
So R3 and R4. Nope, that's not going to help me. <sighs> I don't know what to put in. Yes, I do, because I can zoom into that. No, it doesn't tell you. Oh my goodness. Maybe it's just them then. Let's try it. Four oh two blank. I think that's it. Right. Let's switch that on. Wait for it to go up to temperature. Okay, and solder these in. Okay. Right. Pop that away. And then we need to test this. So I'm going to leave that running for the moment. Yep, that should be on 20, so that's fine. And let's go around and check all of these. Or all of the ones that we can. Um... Yep, that's perfect. That's in range. We've just put them two in, so that'll be fine. That's in range. Yep. Oh, easy. Yep. 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 Right, no. So, resistor 402 blank. Look at Jolly go. Right, desolder it. Then give us this one. Okay. Um and then we need to set this up. Oh, it doesn't tell you how to. Yeah, that's not going to plug in there. Um, turn the soldering iron off. Hmm. What's that key for? Oh, I know. We already we've been in there. Oh. <gasps> Jolly's discovering stuff. Server. Box. Right, can you put the boxes? Yes, you can. Unlocks the server. Um, unlocks after server hero calls. Um, I don't seem to have picked them up. Right, let's put them in there. I don't know what this is, so let's pop it in there. And that one. Okay. How do I complete these? Um, oh no, Jolly, what have you done? Right, I don't understand that. What's this? Don't know. Light. Electric box. Um, what do I do now? Um, contracts. Active. I've done them both. Do I put them in a box? Nope. Do I put them at the door? Nope. Do I just end the day? Let's try it.
Can't click anywhere there. Maybe I'll just wait for the thing, but I doubt it. Oh, that's a bit annoying. Okay, I'll be back in a moment. Sorry about that, everyone. So you put it on the rack, don't you? Um, I only played this yesterday, but I'd already forgotten. So um, we can send these out now. So I picked both of them up, placed them on the rack, and then, yeah, Q to open phone, or you can do it through the PC. Send and send. And will earn you can also buy yourself furniture and refresh your office. Press D to enter office decorating wall. Okay. Um, so wall. One last important point. Go to the bank's application. Okay, we'll do that in a second. So you can, um. Oh, that looks nice, doesn't it? Yeah, let's go for white because, um, it's cleaner looking. And the floor, when I come down the stairs. I feel like, oh, it's not going to change anyway. Let me show you quickly. When you're looking down, oh, it's not so bad now because the walls are a different color. Okay. Yeah, that's fine for now. Um, right, I don't think we're going to need these boxes ever. So let's do that. And let's have a quick look on here. So plants, furniture. Okay. <laughs> right, we don't need any of that at the moment. So let's go to the bank. Um, so bank application. There we go. Here you will find the history of transactions. Go to the loans tab. If you ever run out of money, you can find available loans here. God, 25% interest. Tab now. Okay. Here you will find the weekly expenses. Remember to pay them. If you don't, you will start to crew interest. Okay. And now you can proceed on your own. Keep growing and keep working. Okay. Um, well, I think oh, what... I almost forgot. <laughs> I have one more thing for you that you might find interesting. It's in the store as a marketplace tab. Take a look at it in your spare time. Marketplace. Um, here you will find offers of various types of broken boards, which you can purchase at a lower price. If you repair them, you can sell them at a profit. Clearing the board adds a bonus. Clearing? Cleaning, maybe? Okay. Um, Fifty-nine. Possible sale price two eighty. Okay, well, it's good to know that it's there. I've got to move something off my screen. There we go. Right, um... So, shall we... God, how do I do this? App shop, what was that? Shall we do another one of these? Because we've got 5,300. Um, I think it's the weekend now. So, one of them... Uh, let's get a more expensive one. Yeah, nice RAM. We'll just get the one and a CPU as well. Um, yep. Yep, we'll do that. Okay, so I might have just made a terrible mis mistake doing that, but that's okay. And yeah, it's Saturday today. So let's um, let's turn this light off. Can I turn the light off in here? Um, right, that's off. Is there a light switch in here? Not by the looks of it. Okay. Right. Well, we'll just um, we'll end end the day here. Um. Yep. And right. So now it's Sunday. We haven't got any deliveries because we've paid for normal. I know I'm probably wasting a lot of money here, but I'm trying to 
Okay, so the light switched outside. Fine. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to, like, get as much in as possible. Right, so pop the motherboard down, and let's see whether I can remember how to do this. I cannot. Okay. Oh, no. I don't want to solder it. What's occurring? I'm sure I just put them down on this computer last time. Um, this desk last time. But it's uh, not letting me. Oh god, don't keep pressing escape. Um, right, what's this? Chat online, chat with your co-workers more efficiently. Spreadsheet. Note. Check the parameters of your computer. Um, it's only $16. Let's do it. Okay, so let's have a look at this. Okay. Um, oh, was it configurator I needed to do? It was, wasn't it? <sighs> yeah, I needed to do it over here. Bugger it. Okay, um, take that off for now. Let's try this over here then. So one of them, one of them, one of them. Can't do the rest of it. Right, add all to cart, check out. 680 again. Okay. I've made terrible, terrible mistakes. I wonder if I put that on there. Oh no, it doesn't let me put it down. <sighs> okay, right. Skip a day again. Yeah, this cost me loads in bills because obviously we're going to be paying for um, electric and all that kind of stuff. Okay. Right, so will this let me put it down? It won't. I don't know what I've done. Um, And obviously I can't do it on the floor, can I? <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Oh, God, I'm really not selling this game, am I? Um, yeah, because it said that that was the last episode we did. It said that that was a way of making money. That was the first, the first little thing we got. Um, okay, so let's go on courses and... Network management, router configuration, new application, items in the store, new missions. Um, unlocks terminal usage, new missions. Unlocks new types of boards for repair and more missions. Let's do this one. Okay, I really like this VR learning Welcome idea. Welcome to the terminal course. So to get started, go into the laptop desktop. To perform the course, we will need a terminal. Open it. Okay, the terminal uses commands that execute a given command. If you remember them, you can write them yourself. If not, use the buttons at the bottom of the terminal. By selecting the right combination of buttons, you type the parts of the command one by one. Once a command is complete, press enter to confirm it. To begin with, let's delete the crack file. First, select the category. Press remove data. Now you need to choose where the file is located. Click change directory and choose the name of the place where it is located. It is on the desktop. So click the desktop button. Then press enter. And press enter. Now we can delete the file. 
Select the remove data category again and choose delete file. Select the file you need to delete and click enter. Good. I will now show you how to recover data. This time we will focus on the order list database. Select the restore data category. Find the file to recover by clicking this gray scan and select a valuable disk. Then press enter. Hmm? What's that then? C? I've, I don't know what I'm doing. Well, I do actually. I'm making a complete fool of myself. So I, yeah, and like terminals and all that kind of stuff. Another My goodness. Can be recovered. Select the restore data category again. Then select check this to recover the data. After that, select the file that was found to be recovered and press enter. My goodness. Yeah, I had Ubuntu and um, it blew my mind. Great. Now the last thing. Regaining access to the website. Select the to begin. My goodness, sorry. You need to connect to the hosting. Click the connect to FTP category. Now enter the FTP IP you need to connect to. The client will always give you this data. But here, for practice purposes, type 31.88 Yeah, I wasn't taught coding or anything, unfortunately. Hosting, so you can manage it. Go into the access recovery category again, and then click config FTP and press enter. So when I see things like this, it just all merges into a blur. <laughs> Here you can set the correct data to make the website work again. The customer will give you this data, but for the purposes of the course, enter in the IP 11.288.417.38 and domain main website when you're done. Click save. You have successfully completed the course. See you later. Okay. Yeah, so... I think this game's going to get away from me very, very quickly. That's nothing against the game whatsoever. I do really like this game, but... I think it's going to be way too complicated for me because I've never done coding and stuff. So, the soldering... um. I'd be able to do so I would be able to keep this series running doing um, repairs and stuff but with the coding and that my goodness that's absolutely beyond me um, yeah I forgot to mention that there's a demo out for this as well so if you wanted to um, give it a try there's a demo on the um, yeah, Steam page and um, I did get another bloody um, horrible thing the other day saying that my Steam is affiliate and I should be saying Steam isn't affiliate so click in that link you can double check this yourself so if you um, go onto the Steam page of this game and just have a look at the HTTP link it'll be exactly the same if you've just gone onto it through Google or whatever then it is on my description so I promise it's not affiliate I've got one affiliate link, and um, that's it. I'm not secretly earning loads of money off it. Anyway, yeah, tangent over. So, um, 
in the description there's a link for the steam game thing there's a demo of it and um yeah i really do think we should promote games like this because um you're learning and uh yeah it's quite fun as well um right what time are we at 30 minutes yeah so i'm gonna leave this one here um i am gonna do another episode and we'll try and do some more vr learning um but yeah that's um that's taken it out of me a little bit doing the terminal because um it's just brought back horrible memories of googling on my phone how to do terminal stuff and trying to get my old pc working and that was an absolute nightmare just typing in code my goodness anyway right so thanks for watching everyone i do really appreciate each and every view nice and if you've enjoyed this nice please feel free to join me in the next one so cheers everyone and bye for now nice